What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode presented by RSWrestlingNews.com. And today we are actually going to be discussing uh, a report by Dave Meltzer regarding the big money that WB got paid for presenting the Mountain Dew Pitch Black match at this year's Royal Rumble between Bray Wyatt and LA Knight. When WB first announced this match, everyone's like, what in the world is this? And most people, including both competitors who had publicly spoken about it leading up to the event, was like, it's probably just going to be a dark street fight. And it was. So they had Bray Wyatt go over LA Knight in this match. And what they did was he had special uh, uh, paint on his face. LA Knight had special attire like his ring trunks uh, lit up. Um, and what they did was they used black light and then the special paint and special material. That way things stood out. They also had like these, I don't know. I don't want to call them necessarily like green balls, but like there was something there. The ring ropes were, uh, you know, they showed up in this black light um, and everything like that including a, a giant Mountain Dew logo on the canvas, which was a, a very interesting thing. And so after the event, uh, Nick Khan, who is WB CEO, he stated on a earnings call that WB is looking to sell sponsorship like what they did with Mountain Dew, where they put sponsors on the canvas of the rings and the turnbuckles of the ring and on the barricades and etc. Now AEW does this currently for their pay-per-view events, most notably with DraftKings. They also had Crackle Barrel at the first ever Double or Nothing event and a few others after that. They even had a match where it was like a street fight with like Darby Allen and he used like a barrel as a part of the sponsorship. WCW did this back in the day. Uh, also earlier this week, there was an executive from WB who uh, told i believe bloomberg could have been someone else that they were looking at doing another sponsorship match for wrestlemania 39 including a cinnamon toast crunch match which is quite interesting anyways according to dave Meltzer, uh wb got paid a million dollars for this mountain dew match and this is what he stated uh and i quote well, you know, the thing is, Mountain Dew won. That was a million-dollar deal. That's significant money if you can get deals like that. It was a really crappy match, though, and they kept it short. I guess Pepsi has to decide whether it's worth it to spend a million dollars to sponsor a crappy match. Maybe it is. I don't know. On a pay-per-view that's seen by two million people? End quote. So that's what that is. But WB did get their money made uh, through that. If you recall, I believe it was WrestleMania Backlash. In 2020, they did a zombie lumberjack match between The Miz and someone else. I can't think of it off my head. So, like, they've done this clearly in the past before. But very interesting. But WB got paid big bucks for that. So we'll see where it leads.